Mm -hmm. Good to do. Hey, what's going on? Just, uh, you know, just waiting to see who jumps on or whatever. But, you know, uh, I'm going to just start ahead anyway. No, I'm just kidding. I'll wait. I'll wait to see who pops on. Give it like a minute. Then I won't waste anyone else's time. But, um, yeah. So, like, I guess, I guess the big thing that's been bothering me was that, like, you know, I've been seeing a lot of Facebook Live videos recently, and I'm like, oh my god, stop it. Stop the craziness. Hey, what's up, Matt? But yeah, you know, I'm just tired of looking at people, you know, being like, oh, life is great. You know, all, all this fake stuff, you know what I mean? But um, yeah, it's bothering me. It's driving me crazy. I can't do it. You know, I'm not going to be like that. You know, I'm going to be like pretty upfront and like not saying life is horrible right now, but, you know, it's not all sunshine and roses, you know, you know, you know birds ain't chirping and stuff like that. No, but really, though, like, you know, I'm looking at the positive, but at the same time, you know, you know, it's not perfect. <laughs> not yet anyway. But, um, but yeah, mainly I, I popped on. Hey, what's up, Matt? Terry? Eric? But, uh, yeah, you know, some of you, some of you know, guys know that I've been through a little bit, you know, you know, I try not to let the cat out the bag, but, you know, it's, it's, it's something that, you know, I want you guys to know, you know, um, you know, and this is, this is a long time ago, so I can talk about it, but, um, when I first started talking about it, it was like vomiting, you know what I mean? But, uh, here it goes. Like, um, in about 2006, around around the time I was getting out of the Air Force, or I was, I was just trying to like transition into a, uh, you know, nice like office job type role. Totally bombed it. You know, it's just, you know, I was one of those hardworking guys that was just kind of like, yeah, everything's great, you know, and then. I guess there was like a, uh, there was a slight like little hint that I might not get anything on my way out when I was in the Air Force. I just lost it. I was, like, you know, they were like, why is it? He's so nice. Why is he so angry? You know, you guys get ripped off. No, but, um, but yeah, I lost my mind. Like, you know, you know, it was kind of like, it was funny. Like, you know, they, they were worried. They were like, like he's gonna hurt somebody. So yeah, needless to say, I ended up getting like locked up and stuff like that. Not like like I got thrown into jail, but like I got through through in one of those cookie bins. It's not as bad as you think, you know. It's like everything's all peaceful and stuff like that. There were people a lot, way a lot worse than off than I was. Um, but yeah, I was I was a a hot mess. <laughs> I remember talking to somebody and. Oh, yeah, if you're wondering, this is going to be pretty raw. I'm not going to be like, oh, my God, life is great. No, you know, I'm just going to let you know who I am, you know, whether you guys like it or not. No, but really, um, you know, yeah, it was like when I was talking to somebody about it, it was like I was getting, it was, it was like I got raped or something. It was like, <laughs> you know, just like letting it all out. You know, it's like a wounded puppy or something. But, um, but yeah, people were like crazy up in there, like. Yeah, I was in the psych ward. Yeah, if you want to guess, but I'll go back there. Um, but I was only, I wasn't in there for that long, maybe like ten days or something like that. They messed up. They let me out. No, <laughs> no. But um, but yeah, like, you know, I guess the Air Force's thing was like, drug them up, you know, act like nothing happened, you know. Uh, you know, it was the Air Force wasn't that bad. Looking back at it, at the time, I was just mad at everybody. I don't know what it was, you know. So I guess the drugs kind of helped for a little bit. Um, but maybe around, mm, I don't know. You know, I guess, you know, it was funny. Like, like the drugs kind of just made you feel like, made me feel kind of spineless, fat and spineless. I would just kind of eat stuff and just be like, yeah, yeah everything's happy. But, um, but yeah, I guess fast forward a little bit, you know, I did ran the same circle. I was like, um, Around the time I snapped, I was like, I want to train to be a pro wrestler. And I just kind of um, worked out really hard, you know. And 
uh, what is, I guess, too much testosterone. And like, you know, I guess at the time I was like, oh, I need some, I need somebody to love me or whatever to like kind of cool me down, cool me down or whatever. But, you know, I guess I didn't have that. So I like just kind of lost my shit. Um, but fast forward, like uh, in like 2009, kind of like the same thing happened, you know, but I was in Saudi Arabia. So I was like on enemy grounds or whatever. But uh, I was a civilian at the time. And like the same thing happened. You know, I was running the same circle. Um, you know, I was like, oh, I want to be a pro wrestler. And I just kind of, what did I do? Yeah, I was working hard, out hard or whatever. The same kind of scenario where I was like working out really hard. And I was like, oh, I need someone to love me. So I ended up just like, losing my shit out there too. She was part of my French. I'm going to curse a little bit. But, um, but yeah, so like, you know, my thing is now like, you know, I've been off the drugs for a while now. You guys, you guys never noticed. No, I'm joking. No, but probably since um, like 2012, 2013, I was like, I don't need this anymore. You know, um, I guess the part that I'm able to like calm myself down is because, like, I guess I figured out, like, you know, just to kind of, I guess a lot of it came through personal development. My friend uh, uh, Elijah, we were just talking or whatever, and he was like, you know. We were, there was a little kid trying to get through something and he was like oh we need to get him on some books i was like you know that's kind of what i did but um but yeah i guess the biggest thing was just like i ended up learning to like love and accept myself for who i was and not you know um not having to depend on someone else's love to like kind of calm me down and then like i kind of what do i say yeah so like this time when i get to that that crazy spot where I'm like, ah, jacked out of my mind. I'll be in control of it. It's going to be kind of, it's going to be nuts. But, uh, that, and, uh, yeah, I just mainly, and also on top of that, uh, mainly I want to say I'm probably going to, you know, start, start trying to be a pro wrestler again soon. So, you know, watch out for that. It's going to be real fun. But, uh, but yeah, that's all I wanted to say, you know, this little bit background on me, you know, they locked me out and I'm out. I'm joking now. But um, but yeah, all seriousness, man. That's it's that's been fun. I like being real with people. Like you know, instead of you know, it's it, this is a little different. Like I don't want to be like, yeah, you guys can do it or nothing crap, nothing stupid like that. But uh, but yeah, that I want to let you know that like you know, even though you might feel like you're like not as healthy as you were maybe like ten years ago, you're a lot stronger than you were. Back then. Just because, like, you're smarter. That's kind of how I look at it, you know. But anyway, all right. Y'all have a nice night. Just had to, like, just had to let that piece out. Like, hey, I was, you know, you guys probably figured out that, you know, there's something wrong with this guy. You know, why is he so calm while everyone else is losing their shit? Because I've, I've seen a lot. <laughs> I've been through a little bit now. But, um, but yeah. Mm, how do I say this? Uh, yeah, I just wanted, mainly I think I did this just because I wanted y'all to know a little bit more about me than like, you know, just the guy looks all perfect and stuff with those pretty little Facebook, <laughs> Facebook profile pics. But yeah, just, I just want to be a little more real to like the people that I know that have known me for so long, but don't really know me because, you know, work is hard. Everyone's out working, and, you know, you know, time to see nobody, but yeah, just want to say we're out here to fix all that. And uh, it's time for me to go pro soon. All right. Have a nice night, y'all.